I'm gonna give you three ways that you can try or get started with Power BI. Hi, I'm Adam Saxon, and welcome to Guy in a Cube, a channel dedicated to helping you and your company gain insights by learning and exploring the Microsoft Business Intelligence stack. And today we're gonna look at three ways that you can go ahead and try Power BI or get started with Power BI. There are different ways to do this and it depends on your organization. So the first way that you can go ahead and get started with Power BI is to actually just sign up for Power BI with your work email address. If you don't have a work email address, go and check out last week's video where I talked about how you can actually set up a test tenant or trial tenant with inside of Office 365 and that'll give you a work email address that you can use. To try Power BI, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and sign up for Power BI, and you can do that by going to powerbi.com. When you go to powerbi.com, the, on the left, in the middle of the screen, you're gonna see Get Started Free. Go ahead and choose that. Do not choose Sign In if you haven't already signed up for Power BI. Sign up and sign in are different things. So you may get an error if you do that. So be sure to try Get Started Free. And when you choose Get Started Free, go ahead and type in your work email address. So you can't use Gmail, you can't use Hotmail, so it has to be an actual organization email. And depending on how you actually sign up, you may or may not get an email verification option where you have to go to that actual email address and select the link inside of the email that you get to verify you are who you are. Okay, that'll get you into Power BI, and that is the free license, that's what that gives you. So now we've got free, but there are other ways or other features of Power BI that we may want to use, and those are included in the Pro option. So how do we get Power BI Pro? That leads us to the second way that we can try Power BI, and that is the 60-day free trial of Power BI Pro. And that trial is within the Power BI service. The easiest way to get that 60-day trial of Pro is to try a Pro feature within inside of the service itself. So if you just signed up for Power BI and you're on the welcome screen where you can get data, go ahead and choose databases, then SQL Server Analysis Services, and then connect. And this will prompt you to try Power BI Pro for 60 days because you don't have it yet. So you can go ahead and select that and start the trial, and then you will have Power BI Pro for 60 days. It's as easy as that. That doesn't actually apply a license from the O365 side of things. This is just an in-service trial that we track on the Power BI side. The third way you can try Power BI is to actually sign up for the Power BI Pro subscription trial with inside of Office 365. You can do that by going to portal.office.com and then selecting admin. This requires that you actually be an admin of the tenant. And if you signed up for the Office 365 trial, you will be an admin of that tenant. Within the Office 365 admin portal, you wanna select billing and then choose add subscriptions. Within the subscription selection list, you wanna scroll all the way down to other plans and in there you'll see Power BI Pro. Hover over the ellipse and select start free trial. And then this will apply a license block of Power BI Pro, of, that, of the Power BI Pro subscription to your tenant. At that point, you can go ahead and add a Power BI Pro license to an account within the tenant. And we're gonna talk about license assignment next week. I'd love to hear your questions or comments. Go ahead and leave that down in the comment section below. And also be sure to subscribe to the channel if you like this video. And for more information on topics like this, be sure to go to guyinacube.com. Every Tuesday I do a technical topic such as this where I either look at a feature, how something works, or how to troubleshoot something. And every Thursday I do an information roundup where I look at the last week, find things that were interesting to me and share that out with you. And really this is about you. I wanna help you be more effective and successful in the things that you do. So go ahead and subscribe and be part of the conversation.